In this video, we're going to talk about how to convert square meters into square feet. Anytime you see square units of anything, you're dealing with units of area. So it's important to understand that. Let's say if we have 0.15 square meters, how can we convert that to square feet? Well, for one thing, we need to know what the conversion factor is between meters and feet. It's good to know that one meter is equal to 3.2808 feet. And if you don't know this, you could just look it up, but either case, you want to find the conversion factor. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the information that we're given, we're going to put it over one, and then we're going to write another fraction. Now we need to decide what to put on this fraction. Now we need to use a conversion factor. So this part of the conversion factor, the one meter, should it go on the top of the second fraction or on the bottom of the second fraction? What would you say? In order to convert square meters to square feet, we need the unit square meters to cancel. So we want to put meters on the bottom. So I'm going to put one meter on the bottom and then the other part of the conversion factor, that's going to go on top because we want these units to cancel. Now, they won't completely cancel right now because we have square meters on the left and we only have meters on the right. In order for them to completely cancel, we need to square the conversion factor. Now, I'm going to take this one step at a time. If we square this, what we're doing is we're multiplying 3.2808 feet by another 3.2808 feet. When you multiply feet by feet, you get square feet. And so this is going to be 10.76365 square feet. One meter raised to the second power, which is one meter times one meter, that's going to be one square meter. So now the unit square meters will cancel. And then we could just multiply across. So it's 0 0.15 times 10.76365. So the answer is going to be approximately 1.6145 square feet. And so that's how you can convert square meters to square feet. Now, let's try another example, but going in the other direction. So what we're going to do in this example is we're going to convert square feet to square meters. So let's say we have 100 square feet. How many square meters is that? For those of you who want to try this problem, feel free to pause the video and uh, take a minute to work it out. So go ahead and use this conversion factor to convert 100 square feet into square meters. So we're going to follow a similar process as we did in the last example. So let's begin by taking the information that we have and let's put it over one. And then let's write the second fraction. So now we need to determine what part of the conversion factor should go on the numerator of the second fraction and on the denominator of the second fraction. And the way you can determine this is by looking at the unit here. We want the unit square feet to cancel. So we need to put feet on the bottom of the second fraction. So this part is going to go on the bottom. So we're going to put 3.2. 2808 feet. The other part is going to go on top. So now let's square the conversion factor. So this is going to be 100 square feet. Let's put our equal sign over 1. And then we're going to have 1 square meter on top. And on the bottom, if we take 3.2808 and square it, we're going to get the same number we had before, 
76365 square feet. So as we can see, the unit square feet will cancel. But this time, we're going to divide instead of multiply. So it's going to be 100 divided by 10.76365. And so the answer is going to be 9.29 square meters. So that's how you can convert from square feet to square meters.